Although most snakes will abandon their eggs long before they hatch, and even leave their live birth babies immediately after, some snakes will stay with their young for a short time. While snakes are precocial, meaning they can survive immediately without outside assistance, some snake mothers are more maternal than others. Vipers and African rock pythons are two good examples. These newborns will often be closely guarded by their mothers for 14 plus days or until their very first shed. In this video, we will briefly mention several notable precocial snakes, as well as a few species who closely guard their babies, almost to a fault. If you're currently watching this video and you're a novice owner, we hope this content gives you an idea as to what to expect if you own one of these specific species that we'll discuss. If your snake is currently pregnant, it is our hope that you leave this video with an idea of what is in the near future and what it could hold in respect to how the mama snake will react and relate to her young. We hope you enjoy this video and we thank you for taking a few moments out of your day to spend them with us. As we noted in our introduction piece, most snakes will abandon their young, either before their eggs have hatched or immediately after live birth. With respect to several notable precocial snake species, here are a few. Corn snakes, hognose snakes, gopher snakes, bull snakes and pine snakes, king snakes, and milk snakes. While abandoning eggs seems like a harsh play, some snakes may even eat their very own eggs. If they aren't removed from their site right away and some time has passed, the mother will forget and no longer recognize them as her own. Although snakes can live and thrive without a mother's support, many fall victim to the elements, predators, Harsh weather conditions and inability to find food and the onset of sickness can quickly end the life of a baby snake. Even though snakes do have the tools and the smarts to survive, nothing can make up for true protection and lack of adult size. So, what about the mothers that do stick around, well, at least for a short time? There are exceptions, but within those exceptions are some very well-known and popular snakes. Let's take a closer look at a few species who have that true maternal instinct. Let's begin with pythons, egg-laying species. Unlike many snakes, pythons will incubate their eggs. They lay their eggs in piles and wrap their bodies around them in an effort to protect their eggs and keep them warm. While most pythons will leave their babies once they've hatched, the aforementioned African rock python is indeed an exception. The African rock will guard their young for up to two weeks. This allows the newborns to grow and thrive, preparing them for the world, thus giving them a huge advantage in the big picture of life. Although most species of vipers produce life-bearing offspring, they also protect their young for an average of two weeks or until the first shed. Some common snakes within this family include rattlesnakes, copperheads, cottonmouths, adders, and bush vipers. Being born of live birth, garter snakes will stay near their young for a period of hours or even days after birth. Because garter snakes are naturally drawn to each other in the wild, this motherly trait is essentially an early glimpse of what it will be like for the baby later in its very own life. While in captivity, garter snakes are but only a few types of snakes that can actually live together. They are wired for family in a roundabout way. What about a baby garter snake in captivity? You can house a baby garter snake with its mom within an enclosure. Although the mother will likely turn its back at some point and refuse to care for the young, the good mom won't eat her babies or fight with them. The largest type of cobra, one of the most venomous snakes in all of the world, the king cobra, is much more motherly than its overall reputation would suggest. Despite being fierce, king cobras will actually build nests for their babies using leaves and sticks. Up to four feet wide, these nests are equipped to hold between six and 40 eggs. The mother will guard the eggs until they hatch, a process that can take up to 90 days. Male king cobras also play a positive role in protection, guarding the nest and taking care of any would-be intruder. While neither the male or female will stay around until the eggs hatch, these parental skills, just prior to the babies entering the world, is very fulfilling and can ensure that the young cobras will have a safe environment early on in their life. 
The final snake that we'll discuss in this section is the venomous sea snake, in particular the live-bearing spine-bellied sea snake. While the vast majority of sea snakes leave their young after birth, the spine belly will give birth in somewhat of a nursery setting. Located in shallow water away from harsh ocean conditions, the baby snakes will thrive in this nursery setting for up to 12 months, eating and protecting themselves from predators. Although the mother will not stay with her young for the entire year, by birthing them and placing the babies in a nursery, they will enter the world with a sense of positive natural protection. Although she leaves, what she has left behind can serve to all but ensure the baby's safety during the first year. And on that note, that will conclude things for this video. However, if you would like more content regarding this very topic, please visit us at snakesforpets.com. There you will find an in-depth article on this specific subject matter that will explore the habits of snake mamas and their offspring in greater detail. If you are viewing this video off-site, please click the initial link in the description box below. Said link will take you to the article in question. If you'd like more information on anything snake-related, please utilize our search bar at snakesforpets.com. Please enter your keywords. If you can think it, there's a good chance we've got you covered with some high-quality content. We thank you for taking the time to check us out. And until our paths cross again, we thank you so much for watching. All the best to you and yours. Have a wonderful day, and we'll talk to you later.